Hey guys, I just wanted to tell you something. I believe that being a graphic designer is the best job on the planet. Let me say that one more time. I believe being a graphic designer is the greatest job on the planet. In today's video, we're gonna talk about why, what makes it different, and if you're a graphic designer and you're struggling, you could be a web designer or a motion designer and you're struggling and you're not really loving your job, this is a great video for you. So without further ado, let's roll right into it. Hey guys, welcome back to another Adrian Graphics and Marketing video. Grateful that you joined me today. Uh, as you know, we've been on this journey for quite some time. We're about at the one year mark of making these videos here on YouTube. So I'm just ex excited that you're back here with us. Today's video is very special to me because I'm gonna talk a little about being a, a graphic designer, what that's all about, why it's such a great job, what are some of the drawbacks that maybe you've been facing in your career, and then hopefully get you some breakthrough. And I got an offer for you guys at the end of this that's free, so stick with me. This is gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna dive into it today. We're gonna talk about why being a graphic designer is the best job on the planet. I believe that with all my heart and soul. It's what got me to where I am today. It's the reason why I'm getting up in front of you and talking about this today. I love graphic design. As a graphic designer, I get to go out there and create and do some amazing things. But in this video, what I need from you guys first is to hit that like and hit that subscribe because this is gonna be some valuable content and I need to hear back from you guys and know that this is working for you. So, being a graphic designer, you get the freedom, you, get, you can travel all over the world and work from your laptop, you can work from home if you want, you don't have to go into an office and work a nine to five. I know there are many graphic designers that are working a nine to five, that are putting a lot of time in at an office and maybe that's part of why you don't enjoy doing graphic design and it's stolen your joy. Well, if you're like me, you may be a creative type that likes to work at night. I'm that way. I do my best work from the hours of about 11 o'clock, 10 o'clock at night until about two in the morning. I don't do a lot of that anymore just because it's not efficient for me. I start my days very, very early, about 5.30 or 6 in the morning. And so because I'm in the role that I'm in, as I've grown from just a graphic designer to a CEO and a speaker like I am now, I don't do so much graphic design at night. Perfect example was last night, I was working on a Power Home Performance logo for one of my businesses. But that's not something that I have to do anymore. I do it because I feel like doing it, I wanna be creative, I wanna have that outlet. And as a graphic designer, I've been able to work my way up the ranks to where I'm at today to be able to pick and choose the projects that I work on with my team. Just fi finished a project for Motivation Everything, which is a great brand. I would encourage you to check that out. But being a graphic designer allows you to have that creative ability. Graphic designers are one of the most important people in our business world. We are the people that take people's ideas and turn them into visual images. Like I like to say, I turn words into images. And we're able to take what people's ideas are and actually give them life. Creating a brand like I've talked about in the past, Crunchy Cottage, and turning that from just somebody that makes elderberry at home to a full-fledged business that is moving people. And recently we did a Facebook post that got over two million views and like 17,000 comments. That couldn't have existed without a graphic designer coming up with the idea, executing a brand, and then developing that into the marketing side. So that's why graphic design and marketing go hand in hand. If you are a graphic designer and you don't know anything about marketing, I would highly encourage you to team up with a, with a marketer or an advertiser or anything in that. Those channel partnerships are really, really key for you. The other thing I love about graphic design, and this is point number two, is the money. I'm gonna be honest. The money as a graphic designer didn't start off great, but now it is. Because I have multiple graphic designers, I have motion designers, I have all these people on my team that are doing social graphics and all these different parts of my business, I've been able to get really, really good at delegating. Just to put it into perspective for you, I started my career selling cell phones, very low ticket, couple hundred bucks at the most. Then I started selling vacuum cleaners, a little bit higher of a price. Then I went and started selling cars, which is, a pretty significant investment for most people and it's not really an investment as we know cars depreciate and it's really an expense unless you're a car dealer and then last one that i did when i was working for somebody was selling home loans which is a huge cost it's one of the biggest purchases you can make in your whole life out of all those jobs i've made more money doing graphic design than any of those 
I almost wanted to say combined, but I can't say that for sure because I don't have all the numbers in front of me, so I don't want to make false claims, but I've made more money doing graphic design than anything else I've done in my life, and I have the freedom, I have the flexibility, I have a lot of great things, and I get to use my creative abilities to create things. If you're a creator and you love to create things out of nothing, graphic design is, a, is the perfect role for that. And there are so many other things that you can do to increase your income, but this video is not about that. I'm gonna do that in another video, and there's another thing that I wanna to talk to you about. One of the other things that I love about graphic design is getting inspired by other graphic designers. One of the shortcomings that I've found in our industry is we don't have enough of those people that we're not just seeing and being inspired by, but we're doing life with. And because of that, there's a few things that I've been working on for the last five years, literally five years I've been working on this, I've executed it, and I've actually put it out there a couple times and really didn't have the time to invest into it until my business on the marketing side was running right, but now I'm coming full circle back to it. And I've actually built out a community. It's called the Instagraphics Pro Network, and it's on Facebook, it's a private group, and we're putting content in there almost every single day, valuable stuff like interviews and motivational memes and just thoughts for the day and stuff that I would normally put like on this, this YouTube video will end up in that group. And the good part about that is there are about 52 or 53 other graphic designers as of today in that group that you can do life with, that you can do community with. So if you're struggling in a certain area or you need a web designer or you need a motion designer or you need a video editing guy, any of those things, any of those creators out there, this is a place where you can one, work with them. You can grow as an entrepreneur and learn how to grow your business, scale your business, do life with all these great people, and again, get inspired. And to be able to build your network and build your community and get around other people. Part of being a graphic designer is you're gonna have those highs and lows. There's gonna be great times, there's gonna be more challenging times. You're gonna have to compete, learn how to compete against the people that are overseas and learn how to get your prices right. And that's what this community is all about, is just helping you grow personally and professionally. Because 80% of personal or business problems are personal problems. So in this group, we're gonna talk about some of those personal things, we're gonna talk about your business challenges, and I wanna help you get breakthrough on those. So if you would please join me, you can look up Instagraphics Pro Network on Facebook, or you can shoot me a direct message, Adrian Boysell on Facebook, and I will personally invite you into the group. I would love to have you. I'm looking for open-minded people, people who are hungry, people who are resilient, and who are tired of getting paid below what they know that they're worth, and want to reach the next level in their career. So if that's you, please join me. Drop a comment if you want to, and I'll paste a link in there so you can get access to it. That might be the easiest way. It's just drop a comment. I'll send you the link to the group, and you can join us there. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. This was a great video. I'm hoping it helped. Hope it inspired you a little bit, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. As always, keep looking up.